Hey guys, welcome back to Free Car Repair. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be super helpful video to any of you having a Ford F-150. And if you guys need to find the climate control fuses, guys, stay with us. We'll explain that in this video today. There might be multiple fuses that you check and some may be under different names. So we'll explain about all that and where you can buy cheap fuses and relays. That way you don't waste your time and money and why it's important to test them as well. All that will be covered today. Before we start, let me tell you a little bit about us, guys. Every single car that we'll get here at the garage will try to make every single fuse video and show you where it's located. Why we do that? Because if you're in the middle of the road, guys, in the middle of nowhere, and you need to find that fuse specifically, it will be it will take you a shorter amount of time to just search for that video instead of looking for a manual in your glove box. And most of the times, people lose their manuals. And if you don't know which fuse, let's say, to replace for ignition coils, fuel injectors, fuel pump, you may be just stuck in the middle of nowhere. So that's why we are making all these videos, guys. We're constantly working here at the garage. We're taking things apart, as you can see. And uh, if you want to check out, guys, we have uh, three channels that all together have more than 1.1 million subscribers. Okay, we have all the mechanical work there. This channel that you're watching right now, we're going to list, okay, the fuse videos here so we can save you guys time, money, and we can make it conveniently uh, for you guys. So let's start on it now. So we'll demonstrate here on the 2016 Ford F-150, but even if you have a 15, 16, or 17, it may work as well. We have two fuse boxes. The first one that we need is right under the hood on your Ford F-150. If you open the hood and you can see this is your car battery here, Behind the car battery, guys, you have that fuse box. Once you open the cover, you're going to see the fuse box just like that. Now, let's first explain why it's important to test fuses and relays that way you don't waste your time and money. So let me explain why it's super important guys to test fuses. Fuses not often you can see if they're burned or they're good. Sometimes they may seem perfectly fine, you think it's a good fuse, you put it back in and you end up uh, spending money and time on parts and problems that uh, do not exist guys when all you have to do test your fuse, find out it's bad, replace it, fix your problem. So we will have a video how to test a fuse, okay different kinds of fuses and how to test relays guys. We're going to put the link in the description of the video below specifically to that video please check it out you can see guys we have different kinds of fuses right all kinds of fuses here and these fuses and relays could be hard to find or expensive and if you're in the middle of nowhere or a small town they may not have them and you may be stuck there so i recommend to keep some spares in the glove box always that's what i do we'll put a link in the description of the video below where you can get them from at a good price and quick shipping the first fuse for the climate control that we need to check guys okay we'll be in that fuse box and we need to come to that fuse panel on the right side and we count fuse number one two three four that fuse guys known as number 17 that we will need to check specifically now we have another fuse that's in the interior fuse box which is located guys in the passenger side food well by that key panel you remove the cover you open the fuse box and you're going to have a fuse box that looks okay you can see just like that so <clears throat> now let's explain okay which fuse you need to uh, you need to check here so you know you know what to expect as well uh, now if the climate control still doesn't work guys check the fuse for the fcim okay the dash control fuse guys for the controls the switches there is another uh, fuse that can control the climate control as well fcim we have the video on the channel so please check it out okay it can be very very helpful guys so the fuse that we'll need to check now guys okay specifically if we come now okay in that row you can see we have number one two three four five six seven those are double fuses here that's a 10 m 10 m so that's fuse number seven eight nine ten eleven okay and then eleven ten so that's 13 and that's fuse number 12 guys okay right here that's fuse number 12 that fuse seven and a half m fuse will need to be checked as well 12 and 13 is practically one fuse double fuse guys right there hopefully the video will be helpful thank you for watching see you next time